So guys, new one for the channel, uh, I'm I've am i started playing Destiny about a couple of weeks ago and I wanted to talk about Zura and his stock today because if, uh, like me, you've gone to gone back to Destiny or uh, you're joining Destiny, you want to know about this because he's the guy to go to, so let's get into it. So guys, first up, where is Zur today? Um, Zur can be found in the tower. He is down near the Crucible Quartermaster and Lord Shax. And how do you get there if you're new? Um, when you spawn in at the tower, run straight forward, head down the stairs, take a left, take another left, and he's right there, uh, right beside you there, before you even hit the Crucible Quartermaster on the left-hand side of that hallway. So let's take a look at what he's got. So first up today is the Legacy Engram. It's a helmet engram today. Uh, it costs 29 strange coins to purchase. Now, uh, why am I mentioning this when you can just buy a brand new engram right here? Well, to be honest, what it is is, if, like me, you've only come to Destiny recently, this is your main chance of actually getting the year one and year two uh, exotic helmets. And some of them can be quite useful, so it, it, might, it may be, if you're looking for a particular year one or year two helmet, this may be your way to do it. So you might want to j consider jumping on this one today. So guys, next up today is the Twilight Garrison. It is an exotic chest armor piece for the Titan. Um, it is 350 defense, which is pretty good. It'll give, if you're new to the game and you're level 40, it'll get you well on your way to hitting maximum light. And uh, what's in it today? Now, if we look here, um, we can see here that it's got tactical air support, which is the main function of this piece. It When double tapping B, it will allow you to dodge mid-air. Mid It'll allow you also to infuse with a new item of higher armor value and of course twist of fate will re-roll what is in the next three columns we have of course in by default discipline and uh, strength we also have special ammo so more ammo for spe special weapons uh, more ammo for heavy weapons void armor so when you're using the defender class you will have even more armor and void recovery uh, increased recovery for five seconds after taking void splash damage so this is mainly for defender titans who like the crucible so let's take a look at the next in the list which is Celestial Nighthawk, it's a helmet for the Hunter class and it is quite good because, it, especially for PvE Hunters, uh, because it let, makes your Golden Gun fire just one shot with six times the damage. And you can see it over here on the left hand side of the tree and it is the talent is called Big Game. Of course, also with Celestial Nighthawk, you can infuse to with a higher level armor piece to get a better roll, like get up to that 400 mark and and twist the fate to re-roll uh, the rest of the talents, which, to be honest, on this one aren't great. This is by no means a god roll Celestial Nighthawk. It has strength and intellect, it has hands-on, which is super energy from melee kills on the minion of dark minions of darkness, super energy from heavy weapon kills on minions of darkness, and bonus grenade energy on orb pickup. So it's a good it's a good helmet to get started on it's good to have that perk for pve but it is really not ideal for crucible so we'll get on to the next one now so last on the list of armor today is the Claws of Ahamkara. It's 350 defense, primary stats being intellect and strength. This is definitely one focused on melee. So let's take a look at what's in it. We've got sniper rifle loader and auto rifle loader, which increase the reload spe uh, speed of both weapons. We've got snap discharge, which increases melee attack speed and momentum transfer gain bonus energy, melee energy on grenade hits. Um, also strength and intellect. So applied to your melee and your super whispers it gives you an extra charge on your melee so you get that extra hit and of course infuse and twist of fate as well so probably the place for Zura today is the Hawkman, a hand cannon from uh, the exotics. 350 attack, great impact, magazine size of 11, and it also has some pretty great perks. So let's take a look at those now. First of all, the damage type on the Hawkman is kinetic. It also has infused, as mentioned, so you can bump that up if you get a more powerful weapon. You have accurized ballistics, field choke, and aggressive ballistics to improve handling. Uh, you have Look in the Chamber, which is one bullet has considerable bonus damage on it. Um, Hammer Forge, range and accuracy, quick draw, 
pull it out quicker, speed reload, reload quicker. Holding aces, two bullets in the clip have considerable bonus damage. And then of course you have the different um, skins for the weapon, which to be honest, I prefer the moon glow. It looks a bit more classy and that's just my style. So guys, that's it for today from Zur. I'm hoping you like this new video. Uh, I decided to do it because I'm playing Destiny and I really enjoy it. And if like me, you're new to Destiny, I thought maybe this would be useful to you because I've picked up quite a lot of stuff over the last two weeks and I've got all my characters up above uh, 300 lights. So I thought you might appreciate a, a bit of a heads up on what's available to you right now. So that's it for today. I'll catch you tomorrow with the live stream. Enjoy your weekend if I don't see you guys. Have a good one.